Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, thank you so much for coming to check me out. I hope that you stay a while and that you enjoy the content and that you feel nothing but love and good intentions and positive vibes as you watch my videos. If you are a returning subscriber, thank you so much for coming back. You guys know that I love and appreciate you. I love you. So guys, just to get right into it, we are doing a video for the Pisces Collective. If you are not a Pisces, you are still welcome to watch the video. It is nothing but love here on my channel, <laughs> nothing but love and light. But this is really geared towards my Pisces Collective, for sure. It's a message that I just felt I needed to do and say and discuss. I just couldn't sleep last night. I was so excited to get up this morning and film this video for you guys. I actually have my astrology shirt on with all of the zodiac signs. I've got my sage burning and I've got all amazing crystals here just for good vibe and just to bless this video so that it gets out, you know, to all my Pisces collective because I feel like it's an important message that we all really need to hear. I even made an outline like it's 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 serious guys. It's like legit serious. I really felt it in my heart, my soul, my being that I needed to make this video. Um, first and foremost, um, again, welcome back to my channel. And if you're new, thank you for joining us. So obviously, if this video is from my Pisces Collective, I am a Pisces. I am a March Pisces. And before I even start anything, I just want to give a shout out to Sasan Pisces. I think I'm saying that wrong, honey. Oh my God, if I am, I'm so sorry. Um, Sasan Pisces Tarot on YouTube. She's got two channels actually, so I, I kind of watch both her channels and then she has Sass on Tarot. I just want to thank you so much for subscribing, honey, and for commenting and sharing my video. You have no idea how much that melted my heart and how excited I was yesterday. Like, I legit found you on YouTube and I started just watching all your stuff and I just felt very drawn to you. Your vibe was good, your energy was good, and I absolutely love your stuff. Your nails are on point, your tarot cards are on point, girl. I just much love to you vibe everything you're amazing thank you so much again i just wanted to make sure i said that and thank you so much guys i'll link all her stuff below for sure you gotta check her out cute nails cute tarot cards amazing vibe great messages like you'll love it you'll love it so now that that's out the way so i wanted just to discuss a, a, like a brief background about us as a pisces collective like i feel that a lot of us and, and a lot of us have felt very, very stuck in the past. I don't know if the rest of you have felt like this, but this is kind of like my story. For a lot, a lot of years, I just felt very, very stuck. And when I mean stuck, like what I mean by that is that even though I knew that there were things that I wanted to do and things that I wanted to get accomplished, like dreams and goals, for some reason, something inside me was just stopping me. Like I felt tied down. I felt chained down. I couldn't break free from anything. It was like very, very weird. It was almost like obviously something very like like spiritual. It was weird. So I've always been very much into like my crystals and tarot and, you know, astrology and things like that when I was younger, but I kind of gave it up because, you know, people look at you weird and people think that you're like odd or whatever. So I kind of like let that part of me like die down a very long time ago and then not too long ago i realized like there was a shift in something like i just felt it i felt it there was a shift in something i wasn't sure why but all of a sudden i started to just not care anymore about what others really thought and i started to really grow into being me i really did like i started to just you know really researching things more that i was you know into in the past like my crystals and tarot i just started to go crazy and i started to research a mass amount of things which is how i actually stumbled upon sasan pisces tarot so what happened was is once i started to realize that there was a shift and i've been saying it for years i've been saying it for years that pisces people were going to come into like this this moment in our lives where we're just going to completely expand and completely grow and nobody's going to know why people are going to be like what's going on is it you know people are going to be confused so upon all my research, I, I watch a lot of readings and things like that. Upon all my research, I noticed that all of the readings and like everything that I was discovering was talking about Pisces people as a collective 
coming into our own. It's our time. Like the universe is telling us, it's our time. It's our time to shine. It's our time to just really, you know, come into our own. You know, a lot of the times in the readings, we were getting like the high priestess card, which is just a really high energy card, which means, you know, it, it's just, it, you're kind of like this being that's chosen. Do you know what I mean? I, and I don't mean chosen like nobody else is chosen, but we're just kind of like a special collective. And I'm not sure how to really explain it. It's just that we we have like these innate gifts that a lot of people don't have. And we're just very like high energy, you know, we we just we just get chosen. Do you know what I mean? And I know like a lot of us always feel like if we're taking on a lot of things, you know, from others and things of that nature. And, and I get it, you know, because I was very much like that in the past as well. But here's why. We're natural empaths. So naturally, we take on and we consume a lot of energy, be it negative, angry, happy, joy, you know, just all kinds of crazy energy we take on. And a lot of us, I feel, didn't really know how to handle that or like didn't really know what was happening to us because maybe a lot of us don't know that we have these natural gifts, you know, like innately with us. But basically we are, we're kind of like a chosen sign because we embody and encompass all characteristics of all the other signs. And we're kind of chosen because if you notice, if you speak to other Pisces people, you'll notice that a lot of them say, we're so nice, we're so good, like why can't people love us or why can't people give us what we give them in return? It's because we're chosen and we're like these type of people that help others with their karmic lessons in life, if that makes sense. So if anybody really is like in need of learning a lesson or anything like that, it's really not personal to us. It's just more of the fact that we are so like special that we kind of help them along this path, if that makes sense. So instead of thinking of it in a negative way, you have to start thinking about it in a positive way. We're just people karmics, people's karmic lessons. We have to kind of help them through life a little bit because that's what we're chosen to do. And then once it's our time to shine and we're chosen for that, you'll start to see the clouds like dissipate and disappear like it's doing now. So because of the fact that I noticed that as a Pisces collective, we are going through this shift and good things are happening now, like our our energy is shifting and all positivity is coming through, like the universe is just really working in our favor. I kind of wanted to give you guys a couple of tips if you didn't really know how to kind of like tap into your energy and all those sources. So a big thing for me was crystals. I've always been interested in them, never really knew too much about them, but lately I've gone crazy. I think if you guys want to check out my Moldavite video and my crystal video, I'll link it all down below, but I've gone crazy with crystals. They really do contain energy and you have to really choose the one that's right for you. Some certain ones call on you and it's just, it's an amazing feeling. Crystals are amazing. Meditation is something that has helped me tremendously. If I do not meditate every morning and every night and maybe a little throughout the day, my day goes bonkers. So if I stay meditated, I'm telling you Pisces, it, it works. Um, mold bite as well has been a very big transformational stone for me I'll let you guys watch the video but it's a stone that really kind of has to choose you so if you watch the video it'll explain a little bit more but mold bite has been a very big help for me as well journaling has been amazing so if you find the right journal for you you know kind of like expressing gratitude each day things that you're grateful for all kinds of things you'll really enjoy it i love journaling i think it's amazing it's a way to kind of just get you back into thinking and knowing that life is really on the right path and grounding grounding yourselves like being outside even if it's just a couple of minutes a day i i guarantee you guarantee you that you'll feel better so those are a couple of the tips and I also this morning actually was sitting as I was meditating and I pulled a couple of cards for us from a couple of decks that I have that I recently got that I'm like obsessed with. I'll link everything that I'm discussing, guys, everything that you see, my coffee, cup, everything that you see here. I promise you, I will link it down below every single thing. OK, the journal card that I chose, which I thought was so cute, <laughs> was wouldn't it be awesome if. And I'm not going to tell you what I wrote in my journal, but it was cute. These are just, these are adorable. They're adorable. Then, funny story, when I went to this rebel pack that I have, 
and I was kind of, you know, I was meditating and I was asking, you know, spirit to kind of give me the cards, you know, that we need to hear as a collective. Not just one popped out, two. And you're going to laugh at the ones that popped out. Winning was the first one. And then in the back is, you got a good thing going, don't ruin that shit. <laughs> I thought it was so adorable. And then some good shit is about to happen. Don't let your issues fuck it up. Crazy, right? I know. I felt like spirit spoke to me. I was like, oh my God. I was like, perfect, perfect cards for the for the video. And which I thought was amazing is my crystal deck. I kind of meditated and I said, what kind of crystal can we as a Pisces collective focus on to really help us during this time of kind of like transforming and really coming into our own? Guess what the crystal was? quartz <laughs> so it says what it is among the most abundant minerals on the planet clear quartz is everywhere but it's far from basic a master manifester quartz is programmable so give it a job to do and get busy who needs it rock hounds quartz intensifies the power of all the stones in your crystal collection where to put it between your eyebrows during meditation meditation when to use it when you find yourself believing the limitations your mind puts in front of you, call on quartz to help you see through the illusions. Clear the mind of self-doubt, surrender to the will of the universe, and start manifesting the impossible. Enhance your vision. Like, hello, come on guys. It's literally, literally our time. So I really, really hope that you guys really enjoyed this video. Um, I know a lot of us want to get started with like our crystal collections or maybe like jewelry that you want to wear you know maybe like evil eye bracelets or you know things like that so a couple of the stores that i found that are cheap and affordable i don't know if you guys knew this or not but michael's stores now have this line called um positive intentions i believe it's called they have the cutest little things you can make your own jewelry they have um crystal stuff so check that out i'll leave a link below as well and Alex and Ani, I don't know if you guys know about this company, but they make really nice, beautiful bangles. They have a lot of bangles in that form as well, um, like an evil eye bangle, things like that. And they have Afterpay. If you don't know about Afterpay, it's a way to make installments on certain payments. I will leave a link to Afterpay as well. Get you some jewelry, get you some crystals, get whatever you need to get to jumpstart your journey into manifesting and really coming into your own Pisces. Like, I love you guys. You have no idea how much I enjoy sitting, talking to you guys, making these videos. Hopefully it resonates with some of you. I, I just really want you guys to know that it's our time, that we are so powerful, that we're so special. Just do it, just do it. Focus on little things at a time, little ways that you can grow. Just please do not let this power of yours go away and just sit and just go to waste tap into it meditate journal pray get your crystals get your jewelry get whatever you need to get to really focus on what you want to do and manifest that shit okay i love you guys thank you so much for sitting and joining with me and listening to my message hopefully it resonates and i hope it comes across with good vibes that's always my intention and yeah any questions comments anything please leave them down below Again, thank you so much for joining me. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel. I've got a lot of fun things coming. Lots and lots and lots of fun things coming. Please, 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 please remember your worth. Remember your power. I love you guys so, so much and appreciate you. We got this, my fellow Pisces. Let's do it. It's our time.